All right, what up, guys? So, James here, aka the Pomp, and today I'm in a good mood. So, you guys get a review. But actually, honestly, I'm just really behind right now. I got like at least like seven pomades to review, and I actually don't even know how many I have like sitting on my desk right now. So, I got to get through them. Um, thus, we will be looking at a water-based pomade today. Um, I've moved up these um, pair of products. Mostly because if I push them back anymore, I'm actually going to run out of product before I even do the review. So that's basically how good or how, how much I've been using them in, in between and before the review. And so I, yeah, I just need to use them because I'm about to run out. So let me introduce to you Type 550 Firm Hold. The other one is Extra Firm Hold. So those are the pair of products and they don't come in any other hole. They don't come in light, medium, they're just firm or extra firm. So they're both relatively like strong products. And so, yeah, so this one was made by palmmates.com, the, the plural word of pomade. So it's different from uh, Mr. Pomade. So, and this website decided to release their own like line of product, which is Type 550. Been really pleased with it. Um, it's a very standard, very um, kind of like orthodox water-based pomade, but that also makes it predictable and very like easy to use on like just like a normal daily basis. And so we're we'll starting off by just looking at the jar. So if you guys look at the jar, as you can tell, you have logos on the front and on the top face. It's this like shield type of deal, type 550, original pomade, and in firm hold. Very clean design. Similar um, jar itself uh, to Imperial and all the Imperial line, but the design work is different. Definitely, I would say somewhat inspired, but still um, very clean, very minimalistic, and just like very nice. And also inside, you see it's a nice transparent uh, water-based pomade. It actually has one of the cleanest scents ever. So. I would say it's as as honestly as good as Railcar, but it's actually really different. Railcar has a little bit of like hit to it, a little bit of like spice, but this product is a lot just like smoother, clean, just really nice in general. And I actually got a phone call, so I'll be right back. All right, bye. All right, guys, sorry about that. But so we just looked at the palm made and we'll go ahead and start like using the product itself and seeing like how it works. So like I said before, it's like a pretty traditional like water-based product. At the firm hold, I would put it at like definitely, definitely like a notch above the Suavecito original in terms of like the hold. But I would still put it, I don't know, probably either equal or slightly below uh, um, Layrite Deluxe because Layrite Deluxe is and was a uh, pretty um, unexpectedly like strong pomade, especially for just like an original and like medium water-based product. It was definitely had uh, like a good amount of hold. However, the texture of this product is uh, slightly softer than the uh, Suavecito original. Um, that also makes it a little easier to apply. The extra firm hold product it's actually pretty similar in texture still, despite an increase in like hold. So they're still both the same, very similar product, same scent, just difference in hold. So as you guys can tell, really easy to apply to the hair. Really make sure to get it down there to get like an even distribution. But yeah, it's also good to finally review another uh, water-based pomade after doing s so many oil bases recently. It's just nice to switch things up every once in a while. So I've been taking uh, pretty small scoops, so I'll go ahead and take one more. And that should definitely be enough for today. Because I'm honestly just styling my hair for you guys real quick. And 
<laughs> I'm about to go to sleep anyways. Like, honestly, this, like, aroma from the pomade is, like, fantastic. A little bit of sweetness, really crisp, and, like, a very smooth, like, cologne type of smell to it. Like, in comparison to Suavecito, some people might compare it. I can see how people can, can, can compare it, but it's, uh, how should I say? It's not as sweet, and it's a little more, like, crisp. So with the product all applied, go ahead and slick everything back. And like I said in my last video, I finally set up my camera in a way that I can go ahead and like style my hair in front of you guys despite the, the new situation of my residency here in a, a Houston. But because I'm using like a live view off my uh, laptop screen it's not mirroring my image which makes it extremely hard to style my hair so as you guys can tell like everything is really easy to comb through my hair is not catching at all it's not starting to dry yet it's like really smooth but because this image is not like mirrored I gotta go and style my hair and I'll be right back guys All right, so I think I'm just going to go ahead and call this one done for the review. But so let's go ahead and look at like the hair itself and see kind of what we think about the product. So throughout styling it, it was definitely like around like the Suavecito original like hold like area. It does say firm hold but it would be more like a medium, like slight touch above the medium in terms of like a water base, but still about a medium in general. Um, as you guys can tell, like my sides are held down like pretty like, well, okay. Slightly puffing out. Uh, the part itself is nice and straight, pretty nicely formed. And the pump itself is at like a good height kind of have some splitting back here but overall it's like pretty good shape in the front and like definitely something I would walk out with and stuff like that and of course like I said before the aroma is just amazing on this product so some unique things about this product so similar to oh, I can't think about it I can't uh, think of the name right now but similar to other few water based products this product actually has a little bit of like bounce to it. it has like a light not fluffiness but like it's not weighing down my hair when I comb it it's not like forcing it into a wedge like a heavy like water base or like a super waxy um, oil base would do so nice thing is like if I have the time definitely I can get like a pretty nice pump door out of this also it is a pretty orthodox water base so we do expect it to dry and it will and so it has like a nice locking in feature that it's really makes it just less of a hassle throughout the day and so overall like it's a good product and I'm actually really excited to talk to you guys probably tomorrow or some other day about the extra firm hold which is I, I which I, what I think is like the better of the two products just because there's a touch of more hold which just makes it like a really easy product to use like very like mindless and just like simple and straightforward to use but other than that like this is still a great product if you guys are styling like a short comb over or something like that or just something that doesn't need an excessive amount of hold but you still want like a nice natural lit naturalness and like um, sphericalness to your pompadour while using a water-based product then like type 550 firm hold is like would be like a great choice it's just pretty straightforward so simple to use but it still has this like lightness and bounciness along with like an amazing aroma f for you so yeah so this has been type 550 firm hold i hope you guys got something on the review and take care